I'm absolutely delighted to welcome Irish country music superstar Mike Denver to Hot Country. Mike, you're very, very welcome. And before I start, I would like to congratulate Liz and yourself on the birth of your beautiful daughter, Mia. How are you adapting to fatherhood? How are you, Hugh? First of all, hello to yourself and everybody there in Hot Country. A big hello to all your, all your viewers there tonight. And hopefully everybody's tuned in and sitting back, relaxed with their feet up. It's great. Fatherhood is great. We're having a great time here. We're very relaxed here at home in Pertoma. There's not, a, there's not a whole lot to do, so we have the feet up, relaxed, and uh, enjoying it here now, enjoying the cocooning at the moment. And how is Mia? Mia's great, yeah, the two ladies are great. Lee and Miz are, are, are uh, me and Liz are both doing mighty stuff, so they are at the moment, they're both flying here, and we're, we're delighted, so we are, we're relaxed here, and enjoying a little bit of, I suppose, a bit of time to ourselves. It's a, it is a difficult time for everybody because, as everybody knows, there's um, so many restrictions right here and right across the UK and right across Europe. So it's it's difficult time for everybody, but we're we're making the best of what we can. It's uh, I suppose one of the most difficult things is because the the grandparents, my mom and dad, and Liz's mom and dad, can't get the opportunity to see see the see me and come in and hold her and say hello and that kind of stuff. But every I suppose with uh, FaceTime and with all the WhatsApps and videos and different stuff, we're, we're keeping well in touch as much as we can. And I suppose you're also looking out for new songs uh, to record. Yeah, it, again, with the, with the restrictions, it's hard to get into the studio now at the moment. We'd love to be able to do a bit of recording because we've lots of time on the hands since there's no live gigs now. So lots of time for recording and doing different videos and stuff. So a few new things on the pipeline, a couple of videos done, just trying to get them finished. So we had, the, we had them started before all the, all the lockdowns came. So getting a few things finished up and hopefully getting back into the studio, do a bit of recording, really enjoying that end of it. But really looking forward to the first day that the tell us you that we can lift these restrictions and we can get back on the road we're going to be there and we're going to be rocking it out hopefully that won't be in the not too distant future everything will be back to half yeah. normal again anyway Fingers crossed, I suppose it's going to be a slow process, but hopefully towards the uh, middle of summer, maybe end of summer, we, we, nobody knows as I say, so we just have to go with the flow and we're, we'll do what, do what we're told and we have to follow all the guidelines, which is the, is, is the main thing for everybody because, as you know, it's, it, it's, it's, I suppose what we do is what makes the difference and that's what it's all about. Mike, I suppose uh, you're looking really forward to going back on stage. You miss the stage so much and you've been out, as I was, nearly every night of the week on your uh, concert tour, which had to be cut short. So you're looking back uh, to that again. Yeah, it was a, it was a cut short or concert tour. We were having a great time there working with Brendan Shine and Philomena Begley and Ray and was doing some gigs with as well. So we had, to, we had to put all them on hold, I suppose, but they're all rescheduled for sometime over the summer and some of them a little later on in the year, but they're all going to take place again and we're, we're, we're really looking forward to getting back on the road because it's it's what we do and it's what we love doing and when you're away from it, yeah, there's nothing else to do really, Hugh. When you're, when you're used to the road, you just miss it so much. I miss meeting the guys in the band. We've been, I've had a, a few phone calls here and there and a few few whatsapps and texts and stuff but it's not the same thing you can't beat being out there we're, we're, we're a live gig and band it's, and it's what we love doing whether it's in concert whether it's in dance the main thing is to be out there and to be on stage and to be uh to be making the music that's what we love doing and mike what's your message to your fans the message is to everybody mind yourselves most of all stay safe i presume washing the hands and uh everybody keeping i suppose the distance is the main thing for now and it's all going to come good and we're really looking forward to getting back and meeting everybody out there and it'll be back to normal in a, in a short space of time fingers crossed as i say but the most important thing is everybody mind yourselves the best that you can and do, and do all that you can for for yourselves and neighbors and and all the all the people around you if there's anybody you can help make sure and try your best and your web address mike for people who would like to keep in touch with what you're doing you can check out all our stuff there on the, the mikedenverband.com you can follow me on twitter you can follow me on instagram and but any of the social media and the things we'd love to if anybody has any requests or stuff don't be afraid to send them via facebook or twitter instagram and if anybody wants videos or that kind of stuff little messages don't be afraid we'll we'll do our best over uh, over a little bit of time to get them done for everybody mike denver thank you so much for taking the time to join us today on hot country and continued success to you and indeed to your band and of course to liz and your absolutely gorgeous new daughter mia best of luck and we'll talk to you again very soon Thanks yourself, you and everybody in hot country. God bless.